Hey guys, it's Kenny Pops, and welcome to my new series called Retro Tuesdays, where I'm gonna be playing games from when I was a kid and bring them to you on classic consoles. So let's start off with <laughs> Crash Bandicoot. So basically, um, this is gonna be my second try recording this. Um, I'm gonna go. Th what I'm thinking is, you know what? Let's just start with a new game, because I was thinking I'm gonna load the game and go where I was off, but. Let's start a new. So yeah, this is gonna be my second time recording this. Hopefully it records well, because I don't want no more problems recording this. Alright, let's do it. Okay. Yeah, if I'm not talking to <laughs> if I'm not talking much, um you guys are you guys already know why. So basically these Retro Tuesday videos are going to be kept short, they're going to be around like 10 minutes each, uh, 10 to 20 minutes each, depending on the, what game it is. Like Crash Bandicoot is probably going to be like at least 10 minutes because like, Crash Bandicoot is such a big game, like it's a long game. It has like, like bonus levels, um, not hitting areas but it's like time consuming I want to say. It's time consuming yeah, I want to say the game is time consuming. In a good way, like, I loved playing this as a kid, this name is funny. Like, there's some parts that I remember and some parts that I don't. So basically, I'm gonna see how far I can get in 10 minutes. But, I got me an Aku Aku. A triple Aku Aku get, grants you, um, invincibility for a minute, for, for a moment. Let's do it. Let's go through here. Oh, no. Good. I'm gonna go to Because if I go through here. Oh no, I hit the apples. Damn it. <laughs> supposed to not to. It's not supposed to turn. Well, it's not supposed to. Turn. Oh. I know! <laughs> First death. What have I got? Uh. Yeah, if you spin and hit the apples, the apples just disappear. So you do not want to do that because you need the apples and they'll give you an extra life. Friends are texting me. Uh, Alright, Jungle Rollers. Ah, uh, let's do it. Yeah, this be the Retro Tuesday videos are gonna be kept like, are gonna be like a minute, or uh, not a minute. <laughs> That's gonna be a short video. They're gonna be like 10 minutes each, 10 to 20 minutes each. Uh, if it's gonna vary with, each, with, oh uh, with what game that I play, of course. So if like something like Crash Bandicoot is gonna be 10 minutes, but if it's something that I wanna delve into more, that I play, that I have way more knowledge, it's at least gonna be like 20 minutes long. It's usually gonna be like my usual let's play videos. They can range from 10 to 20 minutes. And of course, you guys want me to do a Crash Bandicoot series? I'll do so. I'll do a Crash Bandicoot series after I'm done with after I'm done with my Bioshock let's play. Because I'm not gonna be doing the whole entire Bioshock let's play. Because I'm trying to save up for a beefy computer that can run everything. Damn it! Yeah, basically, what basically, well, my Christmas gift for myself is I want to get me a better computer, of course, so I can do um better editing, better. Of course, I can run like triple A games on here because there's a lot of games that I want to run and that I have, but. My, but my laptop does not let me run it because I don't have the dedicated graphics card. Because basically I only have like Intel or the graphics card that come with the laptop and they just and that's just Intel HD graphics and that's not good. 
that's not good at all. But I'm thankful that it lets me run a couple of games that I've played on my channel. Like all the like all the RE stuff, like Resident Evil 6. It run ran Resident Evil 6 okay, but I have to minimize the window. Um, it ran Resident Evil 5 fine, just fine. It, could, it let me play on 10, 720 by 1080p. If I want to say something, if I want to say it. Yeah. Gonna te text a picture of my friend that I'm recording. There we go. Yes. <sighs> Hopefully this recording comes out fine because the program that I'm using, the x is being a butt. Jesus, I got injured. Oh, I got no more Aquas. Okay, good. There we go. And I missed a couple boxes, right? Oh yeah, I missed boxes. The Great Gate. Yeah. So yeah, basically what I was saying is, yeah. Um, I'm basically, ho hopefully by the end of this year, by, hopefully by my birthday. That's what I'm saying. But if by my birthday I can get like a better computer, because I'm I'm not I'm not gonna get a pre-built desktop, because I heard so many bad reviews from them. That I'm basically I'm gonna be building my own computer, and that's probably gonna be exciting for me. And I'll probably show the process to you guys. Of course, I'm not the professional, so if you guys are gonna ask me questions how to do this, how to do that, I can't answer. So I'm probably gonna show you guys what I what I built and how I did it. Oops, okay. Almost got hit by that. Yeah, go over there. Oh, no, 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 no! Ah, come on, man. I was doing, I was doing way better in my other run of this that you guys will never see. Jesus. There's always a problem, wait. I don't know why it is, but when I ever start a new series, like a Let's Play series, there's it, always a problem that all the footage gets like messed up and I have to start all over again. Thank you and I got my life back. Oops. So happy there's no fall damage. Man, I'm like a biggest sucker for like gaming soundtracks. Isn't that funny? Like if, like if a game soundtrack is good and the game itself is good, it's like a whole different experience. Like uh, for Resident Evil 4 example, like you know when the music is playing, you know there's zombies, like enemies around you. And when the music stops, oh damn it, I could have gotten that. And then when the music stops playing, you know you're safe. But when the music starts playing again, you know there's zombies around you. Oh, they both go at the same time. Okay, cool. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. Ah, I did it again. Thank you, Jesus Christ. I'm like, no, not today. And I got the life back. Cool. Come on. Jesus, I'm getting. All right. I seem like a total noob playing a PlayStation game that. Can you? There we go. I could have crossed, no, I could have, I wouldn't have crossed that in time. 
There we go. Okay. Nice and easy. Screw you. Ah, look at the... <laughs> look at those fire effects, man. Oh, bonus round. Alright. Update save game. Dun 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 dun. Oi. There we go. How many boxes there? Oh, there you So that's it. This is it for it. This is it for Retro Tuesday, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, if you guys are thinking I'm gonna do Crash Bandicoot again, no, I might do Crash Bandicoot if I turn into a series, and I'm gonna I'm gonna basically start off where I'm left leaving off right now. But if you guys want to see other 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 retro games from different consoles like consoles like NES, Super Nintendo, um, 64, Sega, Dreamcast. Uh, yeah, tell me guys and I'll do it. I'll basically do it. And the only games that I cannot run on PS2 games are GameCube games. I can run them fine, but they just doesn't let me record because the frame rate drops like really bad and it's not playable. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this Retro Tuesday video. Hopefully you guys enjoying this new series. And this is MK Props. Hopefully you guys like the video, like, share, comment, subscribe, share with others. If you guys are into classic gaming, and this is gonna be a Tuesday, this is gonna be a series that I'm gonna be doing every Tuesday called Retro Tuesday. So thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.